Okay, so you've started your literature review, but where do you go from here? How do you find more stuff? How do you do this properly, systematically, in a way that maximizes your chances of finding super useful literature? And how do you ensure that you don't waste hours and hours staring at a screen wondering, hmm, is that worth looking at? Dunno. I'll tell you how. Two literature search strategies, bibliographic mining and citation searching, or to give them their more relatable names, backward searching and forward searching. First up, backward searching. We'll start by going back in time. As I said, this one is also known as bibliographic mining. So the clue is kind of in the name on this one. It's obvious. Go to the bibliography or the reference list of the item that you've read. Go through it, like properly look at it. You will find other items in there that might be helpful, relevant, interesting for your literature review. These things will have been produced before the item that you read and they will have contributed towards the ideas that were developed within it. So they're worth digging out or mining, bibliographic mining. Next up, forward searching or citation searching. This one is a little bit more involved, but it's not difficult, it really isn't. Find the item that you've read in Google Scholar by entering the title of it in the search bar. When you find it, you will see something underneath that says cited by. Click on that and you will discover loads more exciting stuff there. Well, exciting if you are a bit of a geek like me. This will take you to newer, more recent items that have referenced the item that you read. So that helpful, interesting thing that you read, other academics found this helpful and interesting too. So much so that they referenced it in the thing that they were writing. So these items are more recent than the one that you read. They referenced the one that you read. So it's likely there is going to be something new or interesting or relevant for your work in these items. Now, a word of warning. Once you start clickety click clicking on that cited by link, you are in danger of disappearing down a very deep rabbit hole. <laughs> so make sure that you have coffee and snacks. But more importantly, make sure that you are keeping really good records of your searches. This is super important because when you're writing up your literature review, you might be like, hmm, did I do a citation search on this one? I'm pretty sure I did. Yeah, I'm sure I did. Did I? Avoid that by having a record sheet to track your searches like this one. You could design your own or you could go and treat yourself to my dissertation survival guide, The Literature Search, because this source record sheet is one of the three marvelous PDF planners that come in that particular pack. There's also a 13 page step-by-step -step guide in there where I walk you through the literature search process. You can just follow along and feel confident and assured that you have done everything you need to do to find stuff for your literature review. Okay, that kind of rhymes, doesn't it? Do, review, meh, meh. Anyway, it is available on my website, thedegreedoctor.com, and I will link to that in the description below. If you do want to treat yourself to my literature search survival guide, enter the code YouTube30 at the checkout in my shop to get, well, 30% off, obviously. And I will be back very soon with more Degree Doctor Tips. Catch you later, lovely people.